So today I'm going to show you how to make a Sith holocron. So you can either draw this freehand, or I do have a free holocron template in my Patterns Vault. You just want to put it on a piece of thin cardboard and trace around it. And then you want to take either a pair of scissors or an X-Acto knife or a utility knife if your cardboard's really hard, and then just cut out all the pieces and all the little designs. You'll make three of them. And then coat them all with some watered-down Elmer's glue. That will help the paint adhere. And cover them both sides in some metallic gold paint. Then just take a piece of clear plastic, this is like leftover from a cake or something, and run a little bit of glue along one side of the holocron cardboard, and stick it glue side down onto the plastic. Once that's dried, cut it out, following the edges of the cardboard, so that you have your fake glass in the holocron. And then take a gold marking pen, do this on the inside of the holocron, on the plastic part, and just draw the Sith lines. Um, I took a lot of artistic liberty with this because they were kind of hard to see, so I just kind of made them up as I went along. And that's what I ended up with. So then run a line of glue along the inside edge of one of the triangles, and glue it to the second triangle, and then run glue along those edges, and glue on the third triangle and just hold them until they're all dry. So then take your dried holocron, stick it on a piece of cardboard, and trace the bottom so that you get a perfectly sized triangle for the bottom. Cut it out, and then cut a little hole out of the center. Paint it metallic gold, and then glue the rest of the holocron onto it. It should be a perfect fit. So then you want to glue little pieces of magnet around the hole. These are left over from a magnetic calendar. And then you'll take a fifth piece of magnet, and that will close up the bottom of the hole. So then you can just take a red finger light, stick that in the hole, and put the magnet on the bottom, and that'll hold the light in place. And then your holocron will glow. And you can also, to take it out, just pop the magnet off, wiggle it around until you get the finger light back to the hole, and just pop it out like that. And you can also use a green light if you want it to be the Sith Wayfinder, it's pretty close. So now let's see if it actually opens doors. Oh, here, let me help you with that. Alohomora. Show off.